Service, OO 360, created specifically for interior designers. You can easily create virtual tours and straight into 3ds Max, without additional settings, you just need to upload files to 360 OO Service. Now you can send a link to the customer to demonstrate the project, or publish it in a portfolio on your website. Register on the site OVO360 and create a project. Download a script from the site OVO360 Pro. Drag it into the workspace 3ds Max. In the top menu add tab OVO 360. Customize the project scene. Check the units, they should be in millimeters. Objects in the scene must fit the physical size. Each camera is a point for moving around the scene. Camera should be placed like traffic routes. Click Add OWO Camera. The script creates a new folder OWO360, which will add the camera. For further work, you simply hide the folder and the cameras will not disturb you. When creating a new camera, you need to choose, create a new camera or copy an existing one. If you want to copy the configured camera, click Yes and select the camera from the list. After creating the camera, check its position in space. The camera must be oriented along the x-axis and be parallel to the plane. We recommend creating a new camera. To do this, click No. The camera is created, it is located in the zero coordinates at a height of 1500 mm. You can height me according to its position. Focus on real sizes. Set the camera to the starting point and place the other cameras simply by cloning them. Hide high poly objects from the scene. Ideally, the main plane should remain, walls, floor, ceiling, doors, windows, large low poly furniture. All planes must be turned out to be normal to the camera or have a thickness, otherwise they will not be visible for the cursor in the virtual tour. Click export geometry. The script will start the process of creating and optimizing the scene geometry. This may take some time. After completing the rendering, you can see the result in the layer 360 AVO, Object Geometry. Files, Scene Geometry and Camera Coordinate Points are added to the project folder. Render Panoramas Go to the Render Settings. Set the resolution to 6000 times 3000 pixels or less. The aspect ratio should be a multiple of 2. If you are using the V-Ray Render, then in the Camera tab, set the camera type to Spherical and the viewing angle is 360 degrees. If you use Corona Render, then add to all the physical cameras in the layer, AVO360, the modifier, Crown Camera Mod. And set the type of camera, Spherical. We recommend making a test render of any camera AVO to adjust the quality. All settings are automatically duplicated on other cameras. For the final rendering of the panoramas, click the Render 360, the Batch Rendering tab with the already configured cameras will open, just press the Batch Render and wait for the result. Uploading files to hosting AVO 360. After the rendering is complete, click on Create a Virtual Tour. A personal account of the AVO360 Pro, and a project folder will open. Log in or register on the site. Create a new project and copy all the files from the project folder. For the virtual tour to work correctly, you must have, the scene geometry file, camera coordinate files and panorama renders in the JPEG format. Names must be numbered starting from 001 without a space. The tour is available on the link in your account. If you want to publish it on your website without reference to our service, Use the code to insert the iframe. Link in the description.